Prepare for battle. Hey everybody, Antibody here, bringing you another interview with, uh, this time a player from Germany, Three, Mirio. Two, so one, let's get started. Alright, so first of all, uh, tell me a little bit about yourself. Yeah, well, uh, I'm Mirio from Germany. I live close to Frankfurt. Uh, playing Nexius since 2006. 2006, so that's like four years. Man, that's that's a crazy long time. <laughs> yeah, what? since uh, 2.0. So what kept you playing for so long? Oh, yeah, my, my clan buddy, Mizio. We were playing uh, every day and competition. And Nexus is just a great game. I would I would agree with you fully there. So since you've been playing so long, you're, you're probably pretty good. And from what I saw in the game we just played, uh, you're able to cap very quickly, even with super high ping. So what would you consider some of the strengths of your gameplay? Um. Yeah, I'm pretty fast, I would say. My aim is not that good, actually. Uh, and I know I, I know other players really good. Like if he goes left and then he picks the weapon and does this. Um. Yeah. But I lag a lot. <laughs> you lag a lot? Yeah, sometimes there's a little lag and then I fall off the map or so, so I hate space maps. <laughs> fuck, fuck so, space So one second words. you're doing well and the next second you're falling into space. Yeah, that's so annoying. Alright, so you, you mentioned that you need to improve on your aim. Um, I guess that has a little, little bit to do with lag, but what are some of the other things that you would consider that you're weak at? Um, like, what do you need to improve upon in your game? Yeah, in one was one death match. I can't control the map. Uh, pretty good, so I never get a weapon and stuff like that, and I'm just fucked. <laughs> <laughs> I You're just flailing get, around. So. Yeah, good players always rate me like um, thirty. Five or so. Who do you play against? Uh, Dim. Pretty good player in Europe. He was in the final with Kojin in the one with one tourney. Yeah, and Kojin himself, well, he beats me 60 frags or so. Um, he tends to do that most often. Yeah. <laughs> So, uh, any other players you play with uh, frequently? How about um, how about the other members of the the bot clan? You're you're involved in the bot clan. Tell me a yeah, little we, bit about that. Yeah, we the guys who are active at the moment, like six guys. We play a lot. One was one or team death match. Uh, pretty same skill level, so it's well balanced and fun. I still learn a lot of them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, so we're just a couple of months, hopefully, away from uh, a Zenotic beta or a full-on Zenotic release. We don't, we don't really know. No dates have been released. But uh, what are you most looking forward to in Zenotic? Um, I'm looking forward for new players and new teams. And some competitions, so uh, the player base is pretty small now. And yeah, I just hope that new players will stick to the game and some tourneys and cups, stuff like that. What are what are some of your predictions? Do you think all the old people are going to continue to stay, or do you think that we're going to see some people leave and a whole influx of new players, or both? Uh, I think 
Also, for Europe now, the players won't stay at Nexus because the main server, the DCC, I think they have six server. They will move to Synodic, so they won't be good server here. Right. Um, right so when it when it turns Synodic, do you think you'll see them go to other games, or do you do you feel like that the community over there is strong, where they're they're just going to start learning Synodic again? Because it is a pretty different game. Yeah, that's right. I don't like the movie uh, movement, by the way. <laughs> but yeah, everyone has to learn it. Coach in two, so everyone can be the master. Right, and now's the time to get some practice in before it's before it's actually released. We're the we're members of a very small community, uh, which I really like. But um, you know, it does have its challenges. Uh, what do you see as some of the bigger challenges that the project has to uh, get over before a release? Ooh. I think it needs to be. Um, they need to be more promotion for it. I don't know, like trailers or something. But I guess we need to wait for the beta version until someone can do a nice trailer. <coughs> I hear you. Um, I'm I'm trying to help out with that effort. This is. This is a bit of a PR project. Um, yeah. So for for Zenotic, we're expecting a whole bunch of new players. You know, it's it's going to be a completely new game, as we said before. Um, do you have any advice for new players coming in? Something you may have learned over your uh, four years or so with Nexius? Oh yeah, uh, they have to join the forums and go to IRC maybe to. The community is really, really friendly and helpful to everyone who is nice. And yeah, if you have questions, just join the forums and someone will help you. Community is really nice. I, I fully agree. Um, so, let's see, so the community is really strong. Um, how about Anyone that in that community that you'd like to give a shout out to in particular? Oh uh, yeah, yeah, of course, to my mates from bot and the unconnected guys. Um, yeah, and Kojin, of course, just for fun. <laughs> <laughs> just for fun. Because <laughs> I'm his uh, mascot. I got gotcha, you. Yeah, I'm a I'm an unofficial mascot myself. Yeah. Um, all right, so. Um, You've you've had to, had a lot of time to, to play. What are what are some of the favorite things you like to do in the game? Do you do you have any favorite moments? I mean, I know yeah. you you posted like clips and compilations, which are great. Any any favorites in particular? Yeah, I hate space nets, but I love them because you can push people off it with the laser. I just love to do that. I'm pretty good with the laser. That is pretty funny. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, or just to have amazing frags or funny situations. Um, yeah. All right, like cool. in, in the last three, was the free CTF uh -huh. we played here? There was a funny situation. There were uh, two guys from the other team and one has got our flag and the other one got the strand. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I wanted to get the flag back and the guy with the strand wanted to kill me. But he next his teammate and <laughs> he's just died and yeah, it was too funny. <laughs> nice, nice. Alright, well uh, I'd like to thank you for participating in, and uh, talking to me for this interview. Yeah, thank you. Um, Right now, we're going to leave all the viewers with some some uh, some demo action of you you tearing up some people, hopefully. So uh, thanks again. Thanks. All right. Cool. Move like taken. Like